March 1930, American Clyde Tombow discovers Pluto. July 1978, Pluto's moon Charon is discovered. January 2006, New Horizons launched. Estimated to reach Pluto, 2015. New Horizons and Cataract Pluto. Expect to be surprised. Recalculating. 0.5 degrees. <clears throat> Hello, New Horizons. I hear you're on your way to meet Pluto. So am I. Can you tell me a little about your mission? You are correct. I am programmed to be the first spacecraft to encounter the planet Pluto and study the planet in great detail. New Horizons, I'm afraid you have some misinformation there. Didn't you hear? Pluto isn't a planet anymore. My software has been updated, but I see no change of status in my files. Well, this happened in 2006, just a few months after your launch. Hey there, Pluto! Hey, what's up? I'm here to tell you about NASA's New Horizons spacecraft. It's on its way to see you. I thought you'd be excited, but I also thought you'd be cold and lonely way out here. I'm not lonely. I always have my best bud Sharon by my side. My other moons. Yo. Excuse me, but isn't Sharon a girl's name? Shh. He's sensitive about his name. So, what's this about a visitor? New Horizons! She's a spacecraft on her way from Earth to check you out. Wow, all the way from that overheated rock? You hear that, boys? And she still thinks of you as a planet, not a dwarf planet. <laughs> I don't really care what anyone calls me. Either way, I'm a planet, so hey, tell me about this New Horizons. So what have you seen along the way? I am primarily in a state of hibernation with my eyes closed but I'm awakened weekly to send a report to NASA. Have you seen other planets? Just Jupiter. He provided me a gravity boost to increase my speed. Well, you know, New Horizons had a very close encounter with Jupiter. That big gas bag? It's not what you think. He was just lending a helping hand. I don't know. We've never been that close. You're going through quite a bit of work. Nine years of traveling, 30,000 miles per hour, just for the sake of landing on Pluto. Incorrect. I am not designed or programmed to land on Pluto. First of your kind to go there and you're not even going to stay? Pluto is not my only objective. The Pluto system is simply the first of my encounters in the Kuiper Belt. After encountering Pluto, I will be assigned another target. Kuiper Belt? I've heard of that. That's quite a voyage. So you just keep going? Affirmative. All those objects in the Kuiper Belt, even Pluto, are leftovers from the birth of the solar system more than four billion years ago. Within their cold bodies are the secrets of our creation. It's like you're traveling back in time. There's no telling what you'll encounter. So let me get this straight. She checked out Jupiter, but she's still coming to see me. Um, that's right. Well, as long as she's planning on staying, I guess it's okay. She can't wait to meet her. It'll be a nice surprise. Oh, uh, well, as long as you like surprises, 2015 should be full of them. 